E3 2009, day number one. I'm Larry Herb, Xbox Live's Major Nelson. We are ready to start the show. Inside, Tina Wood has a look. Tina, what do you have for us? That's right, Larry. Tina Wood here, E3 2009, day one, and I'm going to bring you all the fan favorites from the show floor. All right, so we got to start with Halo 3 ODST. Here I am with Paul. Clearly, this is one of the most popular games. Yep. Huge, huge lines. Tell me a little bit about the game. It's all about a group of Orville Drop Shop Troopers. It takes place between Halo 2 and Halo 3. When Master Chief left, uh, we went to Delta Halo. This is the story about Mufasa and what happened to the city while the, while the Chief was away. Old school fans were a little bit upset about the pistol that you guys old. reinvented. Tell me a little bit about the pistol for this game. We started kicking it old school a little bit. We brought back the, the headshot, rapid fire pistol. You can zoom again with it. Uh, we also removed the motion sensor uh, just to get uh, a little bit more awareness of players, sort of make you uh, like ramp up that intensity a little bit. Motorsport 3, people are lined up, they've got these really cool triple screen driving simulators. So you get the real Forza Motorsport 3 feel. I can't cover E3 2009 without bringing you a little bit of sports, but specifically EA's got some great titles. We've got the new Madden, new NCAA, and of course the new Fight Night. It's brand new, built from the ground up with a whole new physics mm -hmm. game plan. So it's got some of the most unbelievable collision detection you'll ever see. And it also rolls into the gameplay as well. So the most organic, fluid, realistic simulation of the sweet science you'll ever see in a video game. How cool is that? The Batmobile. Here I am in a game that needs no introduction, but I'm going to give it one anyway. It's the Beatles Rock Band. It's got a slew of your favorite Beatles titles. That's right. You get to be in the shoes of a real rock star. All right, we got to talk about Tom Clancy's Splinter Cell Conviction. Here I am with Steven. Now, we know there's an enhanced story mode, but really we got to talk about stealth. That's what Sam Fisher came to the market with. What have you done differently in this game? That's right. In this game, we've totally redefined how stealth works. What we're doing is we're taking the traditional concepts of stealth and totally turning them on their heads. We're now much more dynamic, action oriented We're faster and more brutal than ever before. Now, are they still neck breaking? Absolutely, yeah. You'll be jumping off the pipes and breaking people's necks all the time. Got to play Conviction. One hero with an appetite for adventure. Mamma mia. E3 has gone back to its roots, and how much excitement from here on the show floor. What a great day. That is a wrap from day one. Back to you, Larry. Thanks, Tina. That looked great. We're going to be here all week long for Inside Xbox. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.